Hello my friends, welcome to this new practical tutorial. Are you ready to train your model? Let's do it and it's actually going to be a very short tutorial because not only we will only have one line of code to implement but also we've already done it so let's tackle this right now. Alright so first we take our model then from our model we're going to call a special method that will do the whole training of the model and that's of course this one the fit method. So we press enter or you can type fit and then inside the fit method we need to enter two arguments which is of course your training set but split into the two subset we created in part one x train and y train because indeed x train contains the independent variables in the training set and y train contains the ground truth in the training set so that our logistic regression model can learn to make predictions closer and closer to the ground truth without of course having overfitting all right so in the fit method we only have to input our two subset of the training set first our array x train of independent variables and then our vector y train of the dependent variable containing the ground truth there we go and that's it as simple as that we train our logistic regression model thanks to the fit method so let's run the cell and there you go, now you have a trained logistic regression model. Okay, congratulations. And now that we have a trained model, well, let's proceed to the inference mode where we're gonna make two types of predictions, predictions on the test set and prediction for a single patient. Once again, try to do it before me. There will be one slight little difference compared to what we did before with linear regression. So I'll reveal this to you in the next tutorial. And until then, enjoy machine learning.